What drives BGP fast convergence? Especially in enterprises, it is very critical for voice. With voice being a larger portion of network traffic, we are seeing a big push for faster convergence all around, and BGP is certainly one of the routing protocols that gets affected by that requirement. Of course, our VPN customers want IGP like convergence in any routing protocols, just like BGP. BGP convergence is not something that is just a single feature. Usually, it is a factor of what trade offs we make in a lot of areas. The areas are like detection how do we detect failure? Changes how do we detect changes? Propagation. How quickly can we get the entire network to understand that a change just happened? Or scalability. How can we handle large number of changes? And of course, stability. How can we make sure that if the network is churning, that it is not unnecessarily penalizing the network itself? But first, a word from our sponsor, Networking Step by Step. Networking Step by Step offers videos called Video Cheat Sheets, configuration guides, copy and paste ready configuration examples, blogs, surveys, video blogs, and the list goes on and on. All designed to help you get down to the meat of the subject quickly. So the next time your manager asks if you know a particular technology, you can say yes and still have a life. Typically, there are a couple of situations that we focus on. One is the single route convergence. A best path change occurs for one prefix and BGP needs to propagate that throughout the network and the entire BGP network needs to change. But each router needs to pick up the change in order to understand what it means, recalculate its best path and stuff like that. I already mentioned that this is generally quite key for VPN and voice networks because that reconvergence could make a significant impact on the quality of service you want for your packets. The other big area that we focus on for BGP convergence is boot up or clear IP BGP commands. This is typically one of the most stressful situations for BGP. Think about it. You just reinitiated the sessions with all your peers. They are all sending you their data. They're all expecting you to send your data as soon as possible. So you're pretty much maxed out on CPU. Scalability becomes a big issue in this context, especially if you're receiving full internet routes, because of how many peers you can simultaneously reconverge with in a reasonable amount of time. On any router that is dealing with the full internet route table, with several peers is clearly a point in the network where boot up convergence is a big issue. So what drives BGP fast convergence? The same thing that drives convergence with your IGP to minimize outages. Thanks for listening to this video blog with Dale. If you like what you just heard, we hope you will drop by our web address, networkingstepbystep.com, and see the famous video cheat sheet for yourself. You should also play fair and share our web address with your friends and colleagues. Be sure to check out our archive section on our website for previous video blogs.